David Malukas, the highest finishing rookie of the seven in the field, a 16th place finish in Sunday's race. Man, a whirlwind couple of weeks for you in this thing. As you come to the day after the race, what's your, what's your brain trying to chew on the most out of all this? Um, I mean, yeah, what a race. You know, it, it's so long, and the, now, now I understand the meaning of this track chooses its winners. You know, there's, there's so many opportunities, and within those three hours, everything has to go your way, you know, to, to be there in that position, to, to fight for, for the win on the last couple laps. Um, and through all of it, you know, you know, things didn't go perfect for us, but, you know, when I went on track, I felt like, you know, I did everything I could, and the car was there. You know, big shout-out to the team. I mean, they managed to fix that thing up and go back out and, you know, let it, let alone, it was it almost felt like exactly how it was before the crash, and I think it means a big deal, especially since Andretti and Herta. I mean, of course, their crash was very big, but you know, they had to park their car because it just didn't feel right. And, and you know, I think the fact that you know, within that certain amount of time, we had the same exact time, and they managed to get the car ready. So, overall, though, I'm very happy. I, I managed to finish my first race, and I'm, I'm very happy with it. When you climb out of the car at the end, did you just kind of take that deep breath and go, "Hey, I did the 200 laps. I did the 500, and made it to the end." Yes, it was so long, and then we had to do the red flag, and they said, you know, we're going back out. So, you know, you relax, you feel all your sore muscles, and I'm like, oh my, please, let's just end it, please. Um, and then, of course, we had a fun little last uh, three-lap dash, and it was actually a, a fight between me and Kyle for, for uh, the highest finishing rookie. So it, it was very cool ending. Did somebody in your ear during the red flag? You just kind of a zen time right there. What was, what was the time like to pass for you? Um, well, I mean, throughout the whole race, I was actually quite calm because uh, I did a good strategy to not have coffee that morning. Ah, smart play. Yeah, I, I thought it was a bad <laughs> idea going into it because I was really, like, sleepy, yawning, you know. I'm, like, getting in the car. I'm like, oh, no, the, uh, I do not feel ready. But, you know, it was a, a perfect balance of nerves to energy. And then well, as soon as I went out, it was perfect, so I wasn't over hyper. But And at the end there, it was, it was you know, still good energy there. But, no, I mean, it, it definitely when we went back out and it was like a one-lap dash and it was like Kyle's in a few position behind you, I was like, okay. Okay, this is going to be intense. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, congrats on a great month and well done. Thank you very much.